I'm just gonna get a quick meal. Let's go to bed. <laughs> I forget today ever happened. Hey guys, it's Artie Simmer and welcome back to my channel. Today we are back with another part of the Twinbrook Architect. I don't know why I keep saying the, but anyway, uh, I am already on the town view because that's where, uh, I believe that's where we left off in the last part. I asked you guys which build you would like to see me do in this part, but uh, yeah, it looks like there's two other renovations that were added to it, a writing room and an exterior makeover. Hopefully one of those will still be here in the next part, because I don't know, I wouldn't mind doing another exterior makeover. We haven't done one of those in a while, but it was requested in the last video by the Plum Dot to do a teenage sanctuary. She said she would like to see a teenage sanctuary with like a hidden room to a like computer room, hidden door to a computer room. And I think that'd be pretty cool. So. Uh, yeah, that's what we're gonna do in this part, and we're just gonna speak to Bobby Sargent here. Ever since the age of 11, my child has, insis uh, whoa, has insisted on getting a brand new bedroom by the age of 13. I see no need to deny this request after all. Yeah, okay. It seems like these are all just the same. I, I wish they would have came up with, you know, different little stories, but you know, whatever. It's fine. Uh, this room needs a dresser, single or double bed, video game system, rug, and school sculptures okay so this child is meant to be like 13 hmm so i don't know when i was 13 i shared a room with my sister <laughs> so we just had a single bed uh i don't know i guess it just depends on the size of the room but we're gonna go ahead and accept that and then visit the lot uh we'll just leave puppy alone okay i forgot we had a dog in the last part all right here is the house we don't know if we've been here yet before or not. Hmm. Uh, I think that's the one we did next year or makeover for, the one next door. So I don't think we've been here yet. Uh, yeah. It looks like we've decorated this room up here. Oh, this is the one where... Yeah, we messed up on that. Right. Okay, well, we'll begin the renovation because I don't think anybody's here. I don't know why the door's open. I don't, I don't know what just happened, but... Yeah. Uh, this is the one where we added the fireplace, but then it was like going through the dresser in the other room. Let's see if we can get up there and show you guys. This house is really ugly. I don't know what any of this is. This doesn't make sense. There's a downstairs, which I didn't know about before, apparently. What is down here? Looks like a little workshop or something. This is... Uh. Okay, I know I didn't see this last time I was here. I don't know what this is. I guess there's supposed to be a car there, but the people who live here aren't here. Let's just... Uh. This wallpaper is... It's not great. There's clothes everywhere. But, uh, you know what? We're doing a teenage bedroom. I'm assuming it's going to be upstairs. So, yeah. This is where we're going to be. Uh, this is the room where we'll be renovating because we did this one last time. I think this was also a teenage sanctuary. I'm not sure. But um yeah, I don't I don't I don't remember. But uh yeah, this will be the room that we're doing and I think I'm just gonna turn the move objects cheat on and get rid of the chimney part of the fireplace. That way this room still keeps the fireplace but this isn't here and I don't have to close off this wall. And they'll just be like a little thing here because otherwise I'd have to remove this window and then the exterior of the house would look kinda weird. So, uh, yeah, I think I'm just going to get rid of the chimney part. And then, yeah, we'll see what we can do with this room. I might change the door. I don't know, but if I do, I'd have to change that door. Otherwise, it'd get on my nerves. So, I don't know, maybe I'll leave the door. I left it in the other room. So, uh, yeah, we're going to get on with the renovation now. <laughs>
So we have met all of the requirements. It looks like, yes, we have. Awesome. So here's what I did with the room. I used some new patterns. Uh, well, I've probably used them before, but I added them last time. I haven't added any new ones. Probably should, because I'm kind of addicted now. But uh, yeah, this is what I came up with. Uh, I just put the little TV area under the bed over here, because uh, it was a pretty small room once I added this little secret room over here, which we'll get to in just a minute. But uh, yeah, I just went ahead and added this little TV and the play system under here. What is it? Video game system? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Duh. And then I just did this this kind of bed. That's kind of like a half monk bed. I don't know what it is, but it's like a lifted bed. <laughs> Whatever. I put it there. And then I put this cute little chair here in the corner. I believe it's from the store. I'm pretty sure it's from the store. Maybe like the bo boho set or something. I don't know. But I really like that chair. It's one of my favorite items in the game. So I stuck that over there in the corner. I think it's perfect for like a teenage girl's room or something. And uh, over here is just like a little vanity area or something. Because I was just going to put a little desk here or something. But it didn't really make sense since um, we've got this uh, computer room over here. But uh, yeah, I do like for whenever I'm doing teenage bedrooms and stuff. I like to have like an empty desk or something so that they can do their homework or something. So... Yeah, I decided to build her a little vanity or something, and you know, she's 13, so I figured she'd probably be experimenting with makeup or something, right? Yeah, uh-huh. And, uh, yeah, just a dresser. Not much to say about that. Dresser. And then, this over here, I really liked it. Uh, yeah, I just stuck, like, some little toys and stuffed animals and stuff in it. Like, you know, she's getting rid of her old toys or something, or she, uh, isn't to the point where she wants to get rid of them yet. So she just stuck them in some boxes for now. And, you know, since it's supposed to be, like, a 13-year-old, you know, she just became a teenager. She's getting rid of all of her kids' stuff. And, uh, yeah, I didn't put this guy in the back because whenever it goes into live mode, he'll just sit down. So, uh, yeah. I did forget to recolor the TV in the game system. So, I'm just going to make them white real quick. There we go. Now they match the rest of the room. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. And then here's the hidden door. It took me a while to find it. You guys probably saw me struggling. Uh, it's not actually indoors that I saw. I don't think so. Let me see. Oh, maybe it is. I don't know why I missed that. I guess it just didn't look like a door to me. But, uh, yeah, I put one there. And 
Yeah, I really like this room. I think it's really cute. I really like the colors. Uh, I just went with like some little blues and teals and brown, gray, white. Because I don't know why, but I always like doing white furniture anyway. So, uh, yeah, I did go thousand dollars over budget so uh I, I hope they'll like that i don't know any of his traits so i don't know if he's uh frugal or not but i'm gonna go ahead and turn in the renovation hopefully he doesn't mind that i went over budget and we are starving probably should check that before i left but you know whatever all right i think he's home uh yeah this blue guy might be him yep okay awesome and i've never actually used these hidden doors or anything before i know that only um I think only witches can access it, I'm pretty sure. Which, he's a fairy, so, you know, that's probably not the best idea. But, you know, whatever. I don't know what that red line was there a minute ago, but it's 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 fine. And it just blocks out the room, I guess, because it's meant to be a hidden room, so that makes sense. But, uh, yeah, we're just gonna wait, see if he likes it. Um, you know what, while he's doing that, I could make some food. Also, I noticed that this is missing wallpaper. Don't know why. I didn't do it, but it, it is. So, we're just gonna wait for this guy. Oh, okay, he did not like it. Cleared things up quite a bit. Not sure how useful this renovation will be if I can't get to my new items. Uh, okay. He really hopes I was distracted or confused. Uh, okay. <laughs> well... He didn't like it. I guess, uh, yeah, I, I, I probably, yeah, this area over here is probably a little cluttered. Uh, I didn't actually check it. Probably should have received a good review. Yeah, well, we need that, don't we? I'm just gonna get rid of that. Okay, so the bed is accessible. I'm not really sure what his problem is. I mean, that's, we're not gonna take a selfie with him. I mean, I thought the room was pretty. That's accessible. Everything's accessible. Maybe... Let's, let's see about the bookshelf. Hey, come back. Stop taking selfies. Okay, so the door itself is not accessible, I guess. Okay, well. Now it is. Okay. Awesome. Okay, so it looks like everything is accessible. Oh, we cannot sit there. Okay, well. That's a problem. But it's fine. It's fine. You know what? We don't live here. He gave us a terrible review. It doesn't help us at all, but <laughs> it is what it is, I guess. We're just gonna go home and pretend this never happened. Oh, lovely. This hasn't happened in a while. At least we got a fire alarm, so it's it's fine. We're tired. We really needed that food, though. <laughs> oh, this is not great. <laughs> oh, bad things are happening. I guess we can't wash laundry while there's fire going on. Um, where's the fire department? They're I, they're they're not coming. Well, why aren't they coming? Well, at least my dog knows to get out of the house. Let's extinguish this puppy ourselves. Oh, well, that was a taxi. Still no fire department. There's. A just a fairy walking, walking by. Oh, okay. Oh, you're finally here, right? Okay. Just, just get out of the house. <sighs> this part is not going great. Can I get my food at least? No, I cannot. I'm just gonna get a quick meal. So go to bed. <laughs> Forget today ever happened. Alright, it's 8 o'clock. She is eating because she is starving. I didn't really get a chance to eat anything except a salad whenever she got home. So I'm just going to have her pay the bills, get the mail if there is any, and then see what jobs we have available. We've got a powder room. We haven't done a bathroom in a while, so that might be something we want to do. Super Chef Kitchen, Teenage Sanctuary, Exterior Makeover, and a writing room. Yeah, I think we're going to go with the bathroom because we haven't actually done a bathroom since... One of the first couple of episodes. Might have been the first episode, I don't remember, but I know we've only done one bathroom so far. The previous owner of this house had terrible taste, I'm particularly words. Displeased with the bathroom and need you to redesign it. We need a sink, mirror, rug, toilet, shower, or tub. 
Okay, we will do that. Visit the lot and hopefully this one will go a lot better than the last time. Um, we're just gonna pick up their garbage because why not? Or not. Okay, whatever. Some vest. Yay. We want to visit you. No, no one home? No. We're being invited inside. Okay. There we go. So let's have a look around. Uh, I guess I'll go ahead and have her take measurements. So we didn't do that on the last one and things did not go well. Okay, so we've got this tiny little room here. Which, you know, it's just that. But um, I believe we need a tub. So, uh, yeah. I don't think don't think that's going to be the one we're doing. Uh, that's cute. Oh, we've done a renovation here before we did this room. I don't remember where our score was on this one. Hopefully they liked it, but, you know, we'll see. Um, we've got this bigger room over here. That might be the room we do. Let's see what's upstairs on the top floor. Is another stairs. Okay. Oh, right. This had the creepy, creepy room. We don't, we don't want to be a part of that. So, uh, we are going to be doing this room over here. What are we doing? I don't, I don't even know. But we're going to begin the renovation. Come on. Alright, where are we? Here we are. Let's put the walls up. There we go. And this is the room we're going to be doing. It's very dark. It's very gross. But, uh, yeah, we're just going to get on to the renovation now. Alright, so we have finished the bathroom, and I really like it. It looks really awesome. I would love this bathroom in real life, honestly. But, uh, yeah, this is what we did. Got all the requirements. Um, yeah. 
<laughs> not much to say. It's a bathroom. Um, I did put a hamper because I've noticed in a lot of the townie homes, there are a lot of dirty clothes everywhere and it's kind of annoying. <laughs> but um, yeah, I don't know if they have, yeah, they have a laundry room, so that's fine. So yeah, I gave them a hamper and uh, this is one of the new patterns that I added. I don't remember if I made this pattern or not, but uh, yeah, I found it. So I said use it and I just made it a little bit darker and it looked pretty awesome, especially with this um, kind of neutral blue color on the walls. It looks really cool and I, I just love this bathroom. It makes me happy. So uh, yeah, we're just going to turn the renovation. Hopefully they like it. We have 19 Somalians left in the budget, but yeah, that's fine. Now, now, now she's going to come, I hope. Maybe. Because we just told her a minute ago and she didn't show up. Okay, is that her? There she is. She looks like a sweet old lady. I can't remember who I did the renovation for last time I did this house. This wallpaper hurts my eyes. But, uh, and I also can't remember whether or not they liked it. So, I'm assuming it was for her since it looks like it was a woman that I designed this room for. Oh, that looks... Lovely. Hello. We really need to work on some more paintings and stuff because we don't have very many and I never have time to work on them. So I need to take the weekends at least and just work on some paintings and stuff. Why does this keep just throwing the screen around everywhere? Where's she at? Oh, okay, she's upstairs now. Let's go up here with her. Alright, we're gonna see if she likes it. She's gonna talk to me now. She matches her clothing very nicely with her makeup. Do you like it? Please. Oh, nobody likes anything I do. <laughs> what did I clutter up? Everything's accessible, right? You know what? I'm, I'm just gonna see. Push, push. Shoot, get out. Oh. What is inaccessible? I don't understand. We'll light your candle for you. Just burn it down into your bathtub. Everything's accessible. See, I, I can bathe just fine. I can use the toilet. I'm sure I can use the sink. I don't know why I wouldn't be able to. I don't understand. I mean, surely it's not just because part of this picture frame is inside of this. Because if that's the reason... I, <laughs> Get out of the bathtub. Yeah, sink's accessible. Everything looks fine. She can view that just fine. Maybe it's the trash can. <sighs> I should go home and take care of my dog. I'm so sorry, puppy. Let's talk to you. Alright, so I guess I'm gonna go ahead in this part here. We're just gonna take care of Bernie. Hopefully things will go better next part. I hope so. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, or subscribe if you haven't already, and let me know what kind of room you'd like to see me renovate in the next part, and hopefully we'll be able to get a good score and make some progress towards our lifetime wish, because if we didn't at all, would you just answer your stupid phone? Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye!